Hey fam, it's Black Hippie. And so today we're gonna to be feeding my boas. Uh, we're gonna feed three of my snakes. So two, uh, my BCIs below, my albino BCI Kiki, uh, my other BCI, jungle BCI, um, Bowie, and then also Skittles, my Brazilian rainbow boa, who is beautiful, she's awesome. Uh, but yeah, and also Bubba, he's not eating today, but he's there. <laughs> and so I was gonna show you guys kind of like my collection and just like an update on all my snakes and kind of how they're doing uh, and whatnot. So tune in um, and we'll see you on the other side. They're dead. These are uh, frozen thaw, if you don't know. Some people may not know that. Uh, I don't feed live. I prefer to feed all my snakes uh, frozen thaw. So anyways, uh, right now these are thawing out. And so once they're done, we're gonna go ahead and uh, start the feeding. So Bo is not eating today because he eats small rats and we feed him just differently. So these guys are kind of like on a one week, you know, eating schedule. So we're gonna go ahead and feed them. My two BCI boas are currently on large mice. And Skittles is still really young, my Brazilian rainbow boa. She's on hopper mice, uh, but I guarantee before you know it, she's gonna be on these too. <laughs> So this is my jungle Bowie. <laughs> it's my jungle Bowie. This is my jungle Boa BCI, Central American. And she is, I'm sorry, he, not she, is totally ready to eat. <laughs> you think I'd starve these snakes, I don't. But yeah, so uh, we're letting those mice heat up and we're gonna go feed them in a second, but oh, he's ready. Mm. So this was my first snake that I, I added to my collection. This is my ball python, uh, Bubba. Um, I'm feeding today, so I'm not really trying to open up these enclosures because they could smell mice and rats and, um, you know. Anywho. So yeah, this is my ball python. This is where he's at. Um, he's in his hide right now, hiding. <laughs> so yeah, I'll be feeding him on, when do I feed him? He gets fed on Saturday, so. He'll be fed on Saturday. This is a, uh, a blue light, which is pretty cool. <laughs> um, anyway, so yeah. So this is Bubba, where Bubba lives. And I thought it'd be kind of cool maybe to put the blue lights on right now. But um, yeah, he's really good. Um, great snake, I think, personally. Uh, I'll put some footage of me holding him yesterday for you guys. But so this is where he lives. This is a 36 by 18 by 18. So it's 36 inches long and then eight inches high and 18 inches deep. Uh, honestly, he's a male, so he's not gonna get too much bigger, I don't think, but um, I'm definitely gonna upgrade him in the future to a specific, it's a different enclosure. Uh, all my snakes will be uh, moved into different enclosures, but for now, this is what they got and they like it. <laughs> okay, so going next, the next snake I got like literally after I got my ball python, I was like, man, ball pythons really aren't for me, you know? And there's no knock on ball pythons. I like ball pythons. I think they're cool. Um, but one is just, one is more than enough for me. I wouldn't want more than one ball python. <laughs> but boas, oh, I love boas. So most of my snakes are boas. Actually, yeah, all my snakes are boas, except for my ball python. <laughs> anyway, so here's Kiki. Um, she's gonna be eating pretty soon, so she's excited. I'm sure she could probably smell some mouse since she knows today's eating day. They're really smart, I feel like. Um, and anywho, yeah, so she was my first boa, but my second snake that I bought. And I was so nervous about boas, I really was. I thought boas were gonna be scary. You know, I thought they were gonna be like, you know, super defensive and just like nippy. But honestly, I kind of lucked out because all my boas are just like super chill. Like all of them, they really are. And I think it's because kind of how their enclosure is. You can see it's modified. I have tinting on all the sides. So it gives them some serious privacy. So I feel like that's probably maybe one of the reasons why they're so chill. <laughs> but anyway, so she's ready to eat. 
And yeah, so we're gonna feed her pretty soon, but for right now, so I'll show it to you guys here. And this is my boy Bowie here, who you can see is also ready to eat. <laughs> dude i'm telling you these guys are smart like they know they smell it they're just like they're ready for it so uh i'll be feeding them next um but yeah so bowie was actually the third snake i got and he's also a boa constrictor but specifically he is a central american boa constrictor or uh technically his morph so his morph is jungle so he's a he's a jungle all right let's get this right <laughs> he's a jungle boa constrictor imperator right but central american that's the locality so that's where technically he's from uh so central americans they don't really get that big so that's one cool thing about you know them uh and if you look side by side you know kiki so if you look side by side like kiki you know and uh uh, Bowie here, like Bowie's definitely like smaller for sure. Uh, Kiki, man, dude, if I was feeding her like rats right now, if I, was, if I had her on small rats right now, this damn girl would be huge. <laughs> but she's Colombian, so her locality is Colombian, and Colombians get bigger for sure. So if you do decide to get Colombian, I highly recommend slow feeding them just because they can get massive. Um, but anyway, so. I thought in the future I may want to breed them, but I doubt it. I doubt it, but if I did, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe maybe I should, maybe I shouldn't. What do you guys think? Should I breed these two in the future? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Let me know what you guys think. But yeah, so I'm going to feed them in a second. different <laughs> usually she's in her hide just sticking her head out but today she's like searching for it it's interesting very interesting so she doesn't bite me <laughs> Hey, what's up, fam? So we just went and we fed, you know, our boas. So the boas just ate, you know, they're looking good, uh, successfully doing it. And they're currently eating. Um, but yeah, so thanks for watching. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe, uh, get cool content, get more of us, all the good stuff. Um, until next time, fam, Black KP out. Much love, be safe, peace.